right, there we are. What is up, Coretix? Welcome to the 90s and early 2000s car meet. One of my favorite themes. You can sort of call it a retro theme as well. Love this one. What's up? What's up? I want to participate. This one, man, you guys, I, I, I'm I, guessing a lot of you guys wanted this theme because I, I'm not joking. Today was a, a literally a record on how fast the session filled up. It, it filled up in less than a minute. I want to say it was like 50 seconds or so. It, it, it went from like five-ish or six with the mods we had to 30 in literally like 50 seconds. Insane. Insane. It didn't even lag either. It just went, I mean, it, it, was, it was quick. Very, very quick. Some cars moving around. So we were at the top of the map, Polito Bay, because uh, today's meet, we're gonna do something a bit different than what we usually do. Um, I've been wanting to do this for a while. Um, we're basically going to be driving like in a convoy to uh, around the highway and stopping at various gas stations. I think that's going to be very fun. I've been wanting to do that for a while. Um, so that's, that's what we're doing in today's meet. Best era ever? Um, my favorite is like late 60s slash early 70s. That's my favorite era of car. Um, but definitely, you know, the 90s and early 2000s were amazing as well in their own way. Working on getting a 48 piece of Motorfest. Nice. Congrats on the new vet. Appreciate it. Love your channel. Thank you, Rudy. Appreciate it. The one gripe about the new Impaler is that it's under the Sedans class. Yeah, they should have put it in muscle. But. Yeah, I mean, in sedans, it is somewhat, sort of, kind of, well, no, not really. I mean, it, it's it's sort of competitive, maybe, if you don't factor him in the top two, <laughs> or top three, actually, uh, sedans in the class, but, um, yeah. Love your orange vet, not engine swap. Yeah, yeah, we'll put a... <laughs> what would you even put him that? The engine has is perfect. Discord link is invalid. Oh... Uh... Oh, I gotta... Oh, wow, I haven't put the new one in there. Hold on a second. Let me grab that real quick. Uh, let's go here. And then we'll go here. Sorry about that. I updated it everywhere on my channel except uh, my my uh, description uh, for, for this stream. Let's see here. Go here to here. And then... There we go, and here, edit, uh, where is it, Mike is blind, blinded by the light, oh, here we go, alright, it's now fixed, hopefully, go here, Come on, YouTube. Why you being mean? There we go. Okay, that, that didn't... Did that not work? It's not a link for some reason. What? Hold on. What? What in the hell? Well, hold on a second. Let me fix this really quick, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, go here. Discord invites. Just want to fix this so I don't get the same comment a million times through the stream. Okay. There we go. Yeah, that's working. Oh, here we go. That's what it was. I don't think I swear. I didn't swear. Not to my knowledge, unless it was like, unless it was very casually said that nobody noticed, including me. <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, let's get back to it. So, um, again, nineties and early two thousands meet. That link is fixed, so we're good there. Um, so again, we're at Polito Bay gas station. We're gonna work our way to other gas stations around the map. I think it's gonna be really fun and different to do. Unfortunately, it's raining in the game right now, which is not the best. Um, but you know, it is what it is. Um, so, we have the cars wrapping around the store here, um, and then in front of the 
gas station here and also oh this little gas pumps over here as well looking like a Costco in this section but um, and also here but yeah all right let's go ahead and start reviewing the cars so firstly here is mine so it's my Infernus classic did a Diablo build pretty much the same build I did on my recent customization video you cannot go wrong with the purple and the white color combo um, and then these are the wheels from the track category kind of similar to the stocks but just a little bit bigger got the Diablo plate on there um, just, a, just a good car L love the Infernus classic just I wish it drove a little bit better I feel like they should have swapped the handling from the Torero in this car uh, for, for some reason the Torero handles better than the Infernus classic I'm not sure why because you know it should be the other way around but um, regardless Infernus classic is still a phenomenal car love it Next up, we got Feb. He brought the Previon. Love it. That's a metallic green. Got the gold five spokes with the uh, tan interior. Looking good. Cannot go wrong with the green and gold color combo. Any special plate? Notice me. <laughs> nice. Good stuff with the sports seats and all that. Fantastic. Thought that was eat up. Ha <laughs> uh, ha! If it if it's eat up's car, it has to have spindles. So here you are, right here. See, see the spindles. That's eat up's car. <laughs> so eat up brought the penetrator. Got the looks like a modded diamond blue kind of. Very very bright. Go around here. Uh, then hopefully some of you guys get the reference. So this car is called the penetrator, right? So there's the plate. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything, but. <laughs> <laughs> let's continue let's casually continue good, good build I like the color uh, going back over here we got Dorn with the Ardent love this green oh I got the Sprunk <laughs> Sprunk plate nice I like the wheel choice awesome love it love I, I love the Lotus the Lotus is free such a cool car it, it truly, truly is. Alright, we got Jack with the S2000. Of course, RT3000. Love the metallic orange, love the hood. I like a tuner bumper. I like the wheel choice, nice orange theme. I like your style, I like your taste. No bias at all there. S2000 on the plate, it looks good. Awesome. It's funny, I wasn't, I wasn't really much of an orange car guy, and now I have two of them. <laughs> Oh man. Anyway, good build. Oh, the or the steering wheel is orange too. Look at that. Oh wow. The backs of the seats too. Y you did this right. Good job on this. Lots, lots of orange. I like it. Uh, we got light with the ballista conjo, metallic green. Got the cup. Uh, it's like a gasoline green pearl. Looks like. I like the white wheels. A spoiler upgrade. Love it. I, I love the Ballista Conjo. It's such a fun car to drive. It's a good customization, too. Obviously, the, the Ballista SJ. Is that what it's called? No, it's called the, the Conjo SJ by itself. Rock Sir, they're confusing names. The Conjo SJ has a lot more customization, but this is a cool one, too. If you want, you know, the little hatch. Um, Alright, we got Oxivi with the Remus. Some metallic red. Got the chrome wheels. Surprisingly, went chrome, but that is very 2000s and 90s. So you see, look, he, early 2000s and 90s, that, that was pure chrome. Like, that was in. So he, he did it right. Oh, the plate, fantastic. Spoiler upgrade. Got the sports seats at the tack. Very nice. Walking over here. We got Alex. So he brought the OG and Furnace. So, of course, it's a Mercy mixed with the Pagani Zonda. For its back end, you can see. I would love a, a dedicated a Zonda car in the game. Can you imagine how cool that would be? Especially if they give it like upgrades, kind of similar to um, different variants, like the Shin, like the the, the uh, Shinque and all that. Because the Osiris is the Huayra. We don't have we don't have a Zonda in game. I mean, it's just a, a nice pure Zonda would be would be a really good car to have in the game. Um, but like the uh, this is um, Epsilon Black, right? Or pure black, okay. With these spindles. Got the red on the side, nice. 
They better do a Zonda in GTA 6. Who knows, honestly? Who knows? Alright, we got the Ghosted Silence with the F40. Or Turismo Classic. Got the green. Wow. Pretty much everybody has this car in red. Sometimes yellow. I don't think I've ever seen it in green. Maybe I haven't, I forgot, but rarely ever. I can probably count on one hand how many times I've seen <laughs> the Turismo Classic in dark. It actually looks pretty good. Then he has the... Looks like a brown interior. The rain's really ruining this. Uh, but... Looks like the stock wheels, too. Nice Ferrari on the plate. Fantastic. Love it. How do I join all the good folks down below? We're going to drive the next one. We're currently full, though. Uh, we got six with the Stratum. I love, love, love the Stratum. This thing is like a little hidden gem. It's such a good car. It has no customization, like, technically, but it does in a way. So you sort of have to, this is one of those cars where you have to find it with the mods already on it. Yes, it's like those mods that are spawned that you can't normally like put on it. So one of them's a roof spoiler. I think the other one is the lower uh, front bumper with a splitter. Uh, and then you got the badging and a sunroof. There's like a few different, um, so this one has the badging. This one has the spoiler. I think this one has every single part on it. So awesome. Love the blue. And of course, the Stratum has a wide body, as you can see. Look at that. It, it, it comes like that. I mean, it, it looks so good. Like, flared out. Really, really good car. Lo always love the Stratum. Hidden gem, for sure. Uh, continuing to Penguin Screech, he brought the Ruiner ZZ8. Wow, yeah, this is very... This is very fitting for this meet. Very, very fitting. Metallic gray is plate. Oh my gosh. Like the anniversary style livery. Awesome. Right wheels, got the sports seats. Kind of crazy, I mean, to think that Rockstar added this car. Like, nobody really wanted this, but at the same rate, I, I know I can definitely see there's a community for it. The same way no one really wanted the, um, the Impala SS, but it's a good car. There was There's a community for it. So it seems like Rockstar is, is lately, they, they kind of changing the way they add cars and DLCs. Instead of giving people what they want, they're giving us good cars that we still like, like enthusiast cars sometimes, but they weren't specifically cars we were asking for. So it's sort of like older niche stuff, which is not a bad thing, I guess. Even though I wish they'd still kind of mix it up a bit sometimes. But anyway, um, Mr. Impossible with the LG Retro. Damn, those are deep dish wheels. <laughs> okay. Wow. Wow. My god. That's Jesus. That's 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 Godzilla on the plate. Awesome. Of course, Skyline, you know. You you definitely, you know, we're definitely going to see one at the meet. One of the best cars from Benny's for sure. Not be I mean, it is kind of overplayed at times, but it's still a good car nonetheless. Um negative 100 offset. <laughs> yeah. Um, then we already review you guys swapped them. I'm so you guys swapped them to confuse me, bruh. Bruh. Alright. We got we got Linus Linister with the LG Retro. Candy red with the deep dish wheels. I like that. Very nice. This is a really good color. Homemade. <laughs> that's a good plate. Wow. Man, that's 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 a good looking retro. I like the carbon hood too. No vents in the hood. Subtle. This is clean, man. Well done. Like a lowered too, it's like slammed. Fantastic looking LG retro. We got edible Ah, the club. The BF club. Looks like a is this black it looks like? gold wheels this thing his plate love it this thing is such a monster of a club for those of you who don't I mean, I'm pretty sure most of you watching already own this car but if you don't this thing is in the compacts class and it literally has like I want to say average sports car performance in the compacts class it is insane it handles like it handles so well so well 
Really, really good car. Absolute sleeper. It's quick to decent customization. Awesome little car. Uh, we got funny name with the Remus. It's like a white with the white wheels. I like that. Got the racing seats. Nice, nice. The white with the white looks really good. The white outfit too. Huh. Nice. Oh, and then the red in the middle of the suit to match the red racing harness? Is that intentional? Jesus. <laughs> That's pretty cool, actually. Alright, matchy matchy. Uh, we got Tanver. So a... looks like a green? A metallic green Diablo. Stock wheels. It's like a brown interior, like orange almost? Okay. Interesting. I mean, it, it, it's a it's a good exterior color. I don't know how I, I feel like black interior would look a little better with this combo personally, but the exterior color is really good. That's nicely done. That's one thousand percent uh custom color. Very nice. Um, we got triple red with the GP one, of course, McLaren F one. One of the best bang for the bucks in the entire game, even though it's a remove website car. But if you're able to get your hands on one from a friend or event week, whatever, uh, this is such a good car. F1 LM on the plate. I did an F1 LM build. Yep. Nice. This car, it's like, what, like 1.3 million, I think? Something like that? It's such a good deal. That Rockstar could have easily... If they were to add this car to GTA right now... They would, they would 1,000% do one of those Rockstar moves and price it at like 10 or 20 million because the real ones are worth like, they're like worth like what, 20 million now, the real ones, something like that, 30 million, something crazy. So they, they, they could easily, easily add this into the game and right now and, add, and price it at something stupid. Imagine they bring it back. GP1 is back in stock for only 20 million dollars. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. All right, we got Mr. Ghost with the Tyrus. Ah, oh, we got them side by side here. Nice, so the race variant and the normal variant, even though the Tyrus has a little bit of Selena 7 mixed in there, but it's mainly the F1 uh, long tail. F1, F1 GTR long tail, I think. Look at his plate for 2069. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a good one. I like the color on here, I like the wheel choice. Very nice and no livery, nice and clean. It, it does suck, though, that you can't remove the Pizwazer banner on the Tyrus. That's always been a complaint for most people. Th this car, like, if we could remove that and then glitch off the rear sporter, which the game doesn't let you, this car would look insanely good. I mean, imagine imagine this car with no rear spoiler, just a ducktail, and this banner removed. It would look so clean. Like, it would look really, really good. But, Rockstar. Anyway, Talentoso. Ah, with the Banshee! Looks good. Blue with the white stripes. And I can see what he, what he was trying to do. So, he did the glitch of Benny's on here, which have the three spokes, in reference to the Gen 1 Viper three spoke wheels. Very clever. I see what he was doing. But unless you know what you're looking at in that reference, it does look kind of weird at first glance. <laughs> but I like the blue with the white stripes. Surprised he didn't go with, like, you know, the typical plain red with those wheels and no stripes. I would have looked even more like close to the real thing but um very cool at least he got the topless one he took off the roof so nice Ooh, i like the sentinel this one's owned by nico i love 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 this yellow on here like that pale yellow i love the wheel choice gorgeous man love the sentinel classic nicely done personally i prefer the regular sentinel classic over the benny's white body variant Personally, I, I think it's just cleaner looking. It still has a good amount of customization um, and, and it still has that that wide body that's already built into it. There wasn't really a need for more. The Benny's variant is still nice, but th there was really no need for it. I, I think to me that the perfect sweet spot is the, the regular Sentinel Classic. Love this car. Um, we got V Sith, I think. <laughs> so he's got the Previon. Not sure how I feel about those wheels. Um, Eat up, you're Mr. SC. Is this a reference to something? To an S, a, a certain... The we the wheels? Not a reference to anything? Just, just, just a custom wheel? Okay. Alright. 
This like this exterior color is like a almost like a brownish purple. I mean, maybe the wheels is trying to reference, you know, back in the '90s, early 2000s, people were just putting, you know, chrome wheels on everything. So that could be, <laughs> it could be a reference to just custom chrome wheels. All right. All right. So we got Subliminal with the Jester Classic. So white Supra. So he has the smaller five-spoke wheels. I guess he's trying to make it look like the wheels from the original one. I, that's probably the closest you can get in game. Um, I don't know. I feel like he should he should have kept the stock side skirts. I think that would have made this car look ten times better. Um, because I think that's just too low compared to the rest of the car. But looks stock AF. <laughs> I think I think without the side skirt, this car would look perfect. Like a thought if you want that stock clean, you know, super stock looking is super a look. Uh, but all right. We got front runners with the brand new Impaler uh, SZ. Ah man, he went he went really like really 90s and early 2000s on this thing with the chrome the larger chrome wheels i think those are bennies right those are bennies wheels with the stripes the hood vents he went for more like that low that low rider custom look from what i can tell the side exhaust too nice all right moving over here we got demon slayer elegy retro love this color on here I don't know though. Me personally, I think you should have either a roof spoiler or a rear spoiler. To me, both just looks, I don't know, just kind of weird to me personally. But um, I do like this spoiler with the little ducktail flap on top. It looks really good. Um, top secret on the plate. Nice. Good color, good wheels, carbon roof. Nicely done. That Hi Hikari with the Ballista Conjo. He's got the he's got that livery on it. We'll, we'll just call it that livery. <laughs> got those wheels with the yellow green tire lettering. My goodness, Versace on the point. <laughs> uh, nice, nice. Oh, another blue banshee. So D Francis with the blue and white striped banshee. Very custom looking wheels on the chrome. Got the roof on it as well. Viper on the plate. Nicely done. Um, over here, what's on this side? You got Bellman with the Impaler SZ as well. So there's only two at this meet. Oh no, three. I'm blind. Three at this meet. Well, that's kind of surprising since it's a brand new car and they're all kind of close to each other. But got the metallic blue. Hmm. Was he trying to go for like a cop car look with these wheels? His plate is just V8. Space, 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 just V8, okay. I th I think he was going for like, or maybe like a, yeah, maybe like a factory Impala, like base Impala look, sorta. Or like a Caprice or something. Yeah, Caprice, yeah. Oh, with the chrome and everything. Yeah, it's like a base Caprice look. Nice. That's, that's pretty creative, actually. With this, no tents in it or anything. All right. Then behind that we got Cal with the metallic red Impaler SZ. N number one pick. <laughs> I see what you were doing. I see what you were doing. Very nice. Very nice. Looks good. I feel like this car is gonna be forgotten. I think I think Rockstar just had to make it because they put it in the sedans class. I think so it wouldn't be forgotten in muscle, but then they didn't give it the appropriate like straight line performance. <laughs> like what was the point? They should have they should have just bumped it a little bit more. But it is what it is. Um, over here we got Rima with the LG Retro metallic gray. I like those wheels in white. Looks really good. The crew two on the plate. <laughs> He's like, this is what I want to play right now. <laughs> but I'm stuck in GTA. Oh, we got the got the sports seats, the race seats, the vets at hood. Nice, nice. It's kind of nice to see it, you know, an LG retro in a color other than silver. Or, you know, the color shifting purple or 
you know, blue. <laughs> nice. Um, in the last car, I believe, we got Vox with this beautiful penetrator. I love this bright silver on here. Love the wheel choice. Are those white? It looks like white. Yeah, it's white wheels. Yeah, it's not alloy. That's too bright for alloy. White wheels. Legend on the plate. Yeah, I, I don't disagree with you. And the stock spoiler. Great looking penetrator. Beautiful. Um, HSW. This is definitely a, the perfect car to get HSW. This car needs it. This car. Does it have any space on the trunk lid? There's no badges here. Oh, this is 1000% gonna have HSW. 1000%. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Yep. <clears throat> I wouldn't doubt in the next update they're probably gonna add HSW to this thing. Okay, so that's all the cars there, I believe. Let's just do a quick little walk around again. Got my Infernus. The Previon. Got Alex and the Infernus Classic. Got the Ballista Conjo, Remus. Turismo Classic. The Stratum. The Ruiner ZZ8. I said in, I was in regular Infernus, sorry. Well, his headlights are bright. Jesus. LG Retro. <laughs> the brightest headlights I've ever seen. Penetrator. S2K. The Ardent. And then over here on this side. All the way over here. Got the LG Retro. The Club. The Remus. And Furnace Classic. GP1. Tyrus. The Banshee. Sentinel Classic, Previon Jester Classic, Impaler SZ, Lista Conjo, Banshee, LG Retro, the Penetrator, and two Impalers, and of course the Elegy Retro. So, as always, I'm going to pick my top three personal favorites of the meet. This is always really tough for me, but I think I've narrowed it down to a few. Um... Yeah, I think I think I have my winners in mind. All right, so starting off with third place, third place, uh, I'm actually gonna give it to Linister with this LNG Retro. I just really like this candy red on here, and he has you know just the carbon hood with no venting on it. It's just really clean. Looks like it's slammed as well. Ducktail spoiler. It's just a really clean LG Retro. I genuinely really like this. So nicely done there. Like the wheels too and everything. Uh, second place is going to go to pick Banshee equals rigged. No, I'm not picking any Banshees. <laughs> second place is going to go to this Penetrator. I genuinely really like this car. Like I like the bright, bright silver on it. I love the wheels. The stock spoiler, legend on the plate. It just looks really nicely done. No window tint the way it should be. Great looking penetrator there. Um, and then first place. First place. I'm pretty sure most of you already know when you saw my reaction to it. I really, really genuinely like this build. Uh, Nico's Sentinel Classic. This is beautiful. The color, the wheels, the bumper. I mean, the, the whole car. It's, it's perfect. It, it's literally perfect. Gorgeous, gorgeous Sentinel Classic. The color suits it so, so well. Beautiful M3 build there. So, those are my top three personal picks of the meet. Let me know what you guys think in chat. What would you have picked as, as your favorite? Let's just say your favorite of the meet. Um, but, all right. Now we're going to do something a little bit different from what we normally do. So, usually we drive to one location at this point and then start up the racing playlist. Today, we're going to do something a little different. We're going to do a convoy, right? Um, we we want to keep it to just normal traffic um with so let's say we have a two-lane road try to keep it that way um don't pass the car in front of you don't hit the car in front of you obviously so the idea is to go kind of like a little bit faster than highway speeds not floored it's not a race <laughs> um and we're gonna make our way to i'm gonna show it on the map here uh we're gonna make our way to this gas station right here so this one right here so we're gonna drive all the way over there and then we're gonna end at another gas station, which I'll show once we arrive here. So let's go ahead and hop on our cars. Uh, first, we're gonna line up over here, just so we don't have a mess. So you guys wanna make your way over here. We're gonna 
line up here like a let's do like a two two lane wide typical mustang driver the two two lane wide yep there we go space give me space nice nice Get them all lined up. All right. All right. Here we go. Again, it's a cruise, not a race. Here we go. Go two lane takeovers. Probably do a single file here. We'll transition because it's a one lane road. How do I pull up? <laughs> We're currently full. Uh, but if you want to try the next one, all the info is down below. Yes, sir. Looks fantastic. All right, now we're going to pick up a little more speed eat up. A little bit. <laughs> there we go. Nice, nice. All right, you guys, keep following them. I just want to show the cars passing by. Um, just show me. Stop right over here. There they go. Sick. I wish it was daytime, but it still looks pretty cool at night as well. Look at that! Oh, that looks cool from back here. Traffic of 80s and 90s, or oh, sorry, 90s and early 2000s cars. Imagine this is like GTA 6 traffic, basically. <laughs> Typical Mustang driver had me hollering. <laughs> wow, they're flying now, unless we're just falling behind. Jesus, I'm like floored right now. Okay, here we go. We're caught up, we caught up. How did I get caught up in that? It's fine though. It's fine. Traffic jam for real. <laughs> that gas station is a lot further than I remember. We're gonna we're gonna run a fuel before then. Speeding, speeding. Imagine if you can use blinkers in GTA 6. I wouldn't doubt if that's a thing. That was a thing in Test Drive Unlimited series for a while, so I, I wouldn't doubt it honestly. Windshield wipers, blinkers. Eat up stopping there. Okay. Wrong gas station, but okay. That's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll stop here. We'll stop here for a quick sprunk. A quick sprunk stop. <laughs> Sunny Evans, where are you? Quick sprunk stop. Where's everybody going? They took off? Oh, Edup took off already. Jesus, okay. Sprung stop cut short. That's the one we, we used to cut through at Long Haul. Left side. Yeah, you want to go... Yep, on the bridge. Left. Yep. Here, yeah, here. It's Raiders. Appreciate the uh, membership. For some reason, the NPC cars use blinkers, but not the players. Yeah, I've noticed that. Remember when the mechanic used to deliver your car? He would use the blinkers when he was delivering it to you. But we've never been able to use that in game for some reason. What around this way? It's a bit of a mess now. Oh, we got caught up in traffic. It goes from a cruise to a normal session real, real quick. <laughs> Alright. Coming up to the gas station here.
All right. Pick a spot, any spot. <laughs> eat of, eat of, not here, please. You Mustang driver. Franklin wants a payphone hit, bruh. <laughs> not now, not now, Franklin, sorry. Let's go, sponsored by Costco. Cheap gas, cheap gas. Everybody here? Wow. When you put them, when you put all the cars like that so close, it looks like a lot less cars than what it actually is. This range of the super chat, appreciate it. What's up, dude? Everybody's missing out on your new Toyota Prius ZR1 CRD Pro. <laughs> it is the turd pro. It's the turd pro. <laughs> Been here for three years, we'll keep being you. But appreciate it, man. Thank you. Taking it to a all Corvette show tomorrow, so that should be interesting. Gas station car meets are peak. Yeah, it looks so, the lighting, it just looks so good. Love this one. Our next one, I'm gonna show it here on the map if you wanna look on the stream meet up. Actually, I'll just, I'll just hop in your car. That'll be easier. It's going to be this one right here. Uh, let me see. Where? It's like it was like here, like here-ish. No, I was literally there the other. I was literally there the other day. Uh, the one, uh oh, the one we did at the Xbox meet last time. Hold on, let me check. This is uh. Let me see here really quick. Uh, I have a picture. I'll send it to you. Uh. Oh, that one. There we go. I sent, I sent, a, I sent a picture. <clears throat> In the same chat. There you go. There we go. Oh, you paused it? Let me see. Oh, yeah, it's that one, yeah. Yeah, that one. That's the one. That's the one. I like that spot. All right. Somebody has cops. Oh, or, oh, they have a cop car, bro. Oh my god. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, leave this location. I'm gonna get a quick sprunk. I'm gonna get a, a quick sprunk first, though. <laughs> quick sprunk stop. Sprunk is required. It's, it's, it's required. Bruh. <laughs> the Sprunk is very electrifying, it seems. Alright, we're leaving shortly. And we want to hop in their cars. Get in your car. No Sprunk for me. Whoa, we left. Okay. Whoa, that glitched out. The ATV spawn for the. the, the <laughs> that's funny. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Any, anybody want an ATV? <laughs> Do you play Crew Motorfest? I used to. Played as much as I used to, but. ATV moment. Heavy traffic. Apparently, I don't know how to drive anymore. <laughs> Hide the headlights. I'm not broken anymore. See? It's fine. Whoa! My first passenger ride in a Corvette C8 so fast for mid-engine. Nice. Oh, those C8s are pretty quick. I mean, they're quick from a from a stop. You know, from a launch control perspective, a zero to sixty is insane. But after like. 80, 90, 100 miles an hour, it kind of hits a brick wall. <laughs> These are sick emojis. Appreciate it. Yeah, light, 
so I, I had a few ideas, and then Light kind of put them into flourishing. Light design, uh, he designed and made them. He did a really, really good job with those. Almost at the gas station. Here we are. This gas station is really nice. I like this one. We could do like a three. Yeah, that works. Let's do like three. Yeah, that's fine. Nice. No. Very nice. That looks really good. Nice, nice. Looking good. Th these location spots are always, like, th these spots are always nice. Because you get, like, well, at night it looks even better, too, but... Kind of want a Corvette over a Hellcat. And see, that's that's my dilemma. I, I, I picked the ZR1 over the Demon 170. <laughs> And I could still get a, th a third or fourth. Like I think I even might get a. I don't know. I literally have the ZR1 and a Shelby for the price of one demon. It just didn't make any sense. So actually, no. What math is that? That's terrible math. No, that's way off. What am I saying? <laughs> terrible math. I guess I was factoring in the Z06 here that I sold. Whatever. All right. Uh, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start up the racing playlist. We got some. 90s early 2000s theme races and of course the long haul which is locked to the impaler sz only this week so let's go ahead and start it up uh playlist 90s racing we got cannonball run for the first race that's that's uh, very fitting not the traditional cannonball, but this is a pretty fun one. It's a longer, longer race. It's like, look at that. Wild. I did not make this one. Um, off from Kerr. Oh, uh, crew member invites. And. Oh. Alright. Crew members. And open. Oh, there you go. Catch up classic. So chat, we think I think super. I think we'll do sports on this one. You know, we'll do sports classics actually. Everybody's gonna be in. Well, Terrell is not not nineties though. Hmm. I think it should be sports. We'll do sports. Custom vehicles, slipstream, we'll leave all that on. Disable HSW. Let's see. Uh, who is this Zeman guy? He's not on the crew. What? It, it, what? it launched, bruh. Ah. Uh. Well, well, we got him the next one, I guess. Don't worry, he's level three, level thirty-four. <laughs> hey, man, you never know who you're dealing with. I remember when I first made my uh, Xbox One account. Um, I had already grinded a ton on PS4, but I, I wanted an Xbox account as well because I had some friends on Xbox. So. I was racing on there as like a level 20, and I was like winning every other, <laughs> every other race. They were like, who the hell is this level 20? And then I was getting kicked by hosts. It was hilarious. All right, I got the Banshee pick so far. Hmm. Is the is the S2 Cabrio banned? No, it's not. I'm going to pick that. Oh, that would be a fun one. You know, I should keep it with a theme. Huh. LG Retro. 
I also think I'll go LG Retro. Yeah, can't go wrong with the LG Retro. Go the slow, the slow Supra. Here we go. Okay, I haven't done this one in a while. Back the other way, I think, right? Yeah. I was a full of players, clown, rock star. I was 29. It's weird. Classic moments. Still back there? Jeez. Oh, I got wrecked by the Karuma guy. There we go. NFS icon, you passed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Need for speed icon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we do full. We do contact on like normal fun races, but then like more competitive tracks. We do uh, non contact. You always make GTA look so fun. I try. <laughs> hey, man. I mean, this bo this game is basically like a sandbox game when you think about it. Well, GTA Online, that is. So, I mean, it, it's you can do literally whatever you want. So, if you make the most of it, you know, you can have some fun. Kind of like real life. <laughs> You play other games, mainly car games. You know, Need for Speed, Forza, The Crew, Gran Turismo, Rocket League. Sometimes. Oh my God! What am I doing? We'll be doing meets for GTA 6. Of course. Oh yeah. Once once six online comes, I'm 99% sure six is not gonna launch with online. I guarantee they're probably gonna delay that. Maybe like. A few weeks or a month, I wouldn't doubt it. So, you know, once GTA 6 Online comes out, I'm definitely gonna be stopping meets on um, 5 completely and then just moving right over to 6. I'm hoping we have 50 player sessions. Not, uh, so, Edom's asking, am I gonna be doing Xbox and PlayStation like I am here? So, in the beginning, no, because obviously I gotta build an account. Um, I'm play. I'm gonna focus on PlayStation, and then uh, I'll probably, you know, start building an Xbox account later on. But that's not gonna be for a while. So in the beginning, it will only be for PlayStation. Dog meat and GTA. Oh my God. That game's gonna be nuts. I'm really hoping there's, there's 50 player sessions. I didn't think that. I think that's a sweet spot of where it should be. But shop shop car is actually worth its price, in your opinion? Um, I kind of want to say, hmm, which shop shop? Basically, you're asking which shop shop car is the best one from the DLC. Um, hmm. I have to really think that one through because there aren't really any cars that jump out at me, you know, right away. They're like, this is, you know, it's, 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 that's, that's a tough one. I have to really think about that one. As big as the map is, it should be a hundred. I doubt it would be a hundred, no. Because the thing you have to remember is how laggy would be so the laggiest a game an online game is is when you have 
all the players together in one area um, with you know large vehicles, lots of movements. That's that's when the game struggles the most. So you know, obviously Rockstar is going to test that, and I, I doubt I doubt the games with the graphics it has and everything. I doubt it's going to be able to handle a hundred people together in one area. It's just not going to work. <laughs> Fifty is a possibility, um, but a hundred, I highly doubt that. I mean, who knows? Maybe it'll surprise us all. They'll do a hundred. I'd, I'd, I'd be like, I, I, that would blow my mind. Go from thirty to a hundred. That'd be insane. Maybe I'll be there for next... Next what? Can you imagine 100 cars racing? Oh, God. Yeah, I, I doubt they would have races that big. I, I think 50 is a sweet spot. I think that's where it's going to... That's my prediction. If you ask me to put money on it, I, I'd say 50. 50 player session. Maybe I'll be there for car heaven. Hmm. Clipstream. Brakes, brakes, brakes. My friend is broken, I think, a little bit. Go, LG. Go, 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 go. Brakes, 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 brakes. Ah! Sorry, sorry. I couldn't stop in time. Ah, I almost got, <laughs> I almost got wrecked there. Oh, hi, Feb. Speed. Spinner rims. That'd be kind of cool. <clears throat> There's gonna be a lot of references to a lot of different things in that game. Hoverboards? Oh, you're definitely gonna see that. AIs, like, around the side, the sidewalk and stuff on hoverboards? That's gonna be hilarious. boost brought us back full of players it still says 29 maybe there's somebody in queue for spectating how many checkpoints are left okay about 20 ish the shafter v12 up here love the shafter v12 Twitch one day or just YouTube? I mainly focus on YouTube. Twitch is an, an amazing platform, but just I, I I don't know. That's not my thing. Like I, I like I genuinely like streaming on YouTube. So let's go. I really should have picked. The Banshee would have been a fun pick, but I feel like I'd be in, like, 20th place right now with that car. <laughs> this is not as, um, what's the word? That's what I'm looking for. Not as consistent. Consistent is a word. Acceleration! What did I just do? Whoops. Bike after this race, kick one guy for me. Oh my god. Is it even allowed to bring Fast and Furious cars to the... meet? If... The motto fits... I think, okay, I think you meant... Are you allowed to bring Fast and Furious builds to any car meet theme? Basically. Um... 
The answer is yes, technically, but uh, it's not really creative to do that, you know? Shafter V12 versus LNG, who you got? <laughs> well, if Catch Up and Surfstream was turned off, Shafter V12 would destroy the LNG because of the top speed. Oh, this part's crazy. Oh, God, I remember this part. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. There it is. Oh, my God. He blew up. They escape. Fast and Furious style. Catch up. Catch up. My poor elegy is so broken. Look at this. My back wheel has got some nice camber too. <laughs> Getting close to the end. They're catching up. They're catching up. Slipstream, slipstream, slipstream. Give me that slipstream. Give me that slipstream. Or not. Or not. Just don't give me slipstream at all game. That's cool. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. What the hell's wrong with this game, man? <laughs> Why no slipstream? What's going on? There we go. Oh, it's gonna get crazy now. Oh, get crazy now. Come on. Are we, everybody's being so cautious up here. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. Everybody's being so cautious. Oh, the Banshee guy lost it a little bit. Come on! Come on! Do it! Come on! <laughs> Come on! Go, LNG, go! He's gonna get my slipstream! He's gonna get my slipstream! No, 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 no! I got it! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! The consistent LNG. Consistent LNG. See, all we would drive. Just pure, that's the perfect car for a race like this because of the consistency. Rigged. <laughs> Rigged. That was, that was patience. I, I patiently waited for the slipstream. They, they, they should have passed me though. I, I, I got lucky there. I got, I got really lucky. Those tankers on the highway scared the F out of me. <laughs> now the next few tracks are like, the next two are a bit more competitive tracks. And then after that, we got the long haul with the new Impaler only. So that's going to be an interesting one. I wanted to put um, more variety, but unfortunately the Impaler, Alan and I tested it. The top speed is, it's somewhere between... It, it, it's it's just it, it's in it's in no man's land basically <laughs> so yeah we kind of had no choice but to put it by itself that's a lot of money for this race jesus what driving school did you go to dca school <laughs> alan said mrs puff's boating school <laughs> That's funny. Uh, that's a more creative response than what I said. All right. <laughs> Not contact. We'll go here to... I think we'll do... We think in 99 laps. Not kidding. We'll do muscle. I think muscle works. And disable. Well, we are full. Jesus. Okay. Well, then. All right. Well, just hit start, then. That, 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 yeah, that usually never happens, but okay. Hmm. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Uh, the Blackfin is so much fun. I love the Blackfin. I'm going to go with that. I love the Blackfin. Blackfin. Oh. I think I'm going to go with that. It sounds so good. It's not... It's not... The ASP is banned, right? Is it? No, it's not. Oh, no. All Dominators are banned. What am I saying? Yeah. Every single Dominator is banned. 
Um, I'm trying to pick something on 90s, but there's really nothing that's that competitive. The Ruiner's bad, too. Alright, well, Blackfin it is. I like the Blackfin. Hellfire is decent. It's, it's, it's up there. Just depends if the track is too corner intensive, then not really. Well, there's more than one Blackfin. There we go. Corner intensive track. That hellfire up there is going to struggle a little bit. Where was in the GTX? That's a banned car. Remember that every single Dominator is banned. The speed of that thing is stupid. Damn, the acceleration of that car is so ridiculous. <laughs> you should add an HSW Hellfire and cut off the front flares. <laughs> nice. Let's go. Oh, there's a top speed difference, but immediate corner. That's a, that's a terrible corner on my part. A Hellcat versus a C1 Corvette. <laughs> oh, man. It's GTA for you. Oh, here's a top speed section, I think. Kind of. Top speed with cornering. I can take that flat out. Oh, not here. And... Mid-drive! Let's go! Woo! Oh, there comes the top speed of the Hellfire. Jesus! Oh, this car sounds so good. A speed difference again. This car sounds so good. Mid drive. No. Damn. That thing is fast. Oh, I thought I thought I thought the back end would handle that corner better. I, I, it didn't. <laughs> it didn't. What car is the one you're driving modeled after? So it's based on the first generation Corvette the C1. Coquette Blackfit, Blackfin, Blackfit. <laughs> Coquette Blackfin. Can't keep up now. Oh my god, look at this straight away. Forget it. Forget about it. <laughs> We're screwed. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Should have picked the Hellfire. I didn't I, I forgot this race had so many top speed sections. It's like a mix, but definitely a car with a higher top speed will benefit you. You know the Gauntlet Classic Custom would do very well on this track. He gone. Gone, gone, gone. Do you like Fiat? Mm, not really. Well, you should because that's what your truck's made by, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna save a joke just in case. Just in case. <laughs> Rockstar error back to main Oh my god, please no. Oh, that happened to you? Oh, that says 29. Damn. Have you heard of those Yugo cars or... Oh, corner. P1. 
Get back here, light. Don't mess up, light. <laughs> Stay strong, light. <laughs> Even on this track, it's kind of hard to mess up. It's like really open. You have like a lot of areas to... There's like a lot of walls to save you and stuff. Not really a difficult track per se. Ever thought about doing an updated garage tour? Yes, every time I want to do one, they add more garage space and they add more cars and then everything's a mess again. It's... <laughs> At this point, since we're so close to GTA 6, I've decided just to do, like, I'm gonna wait to just do one final garage tour at this point. It's probably gonna be, what, like, 300 cars? No, more than that. We can, you can, how many cars can you own now? Like, 350, I think? Something like that? There's the blade. Blade past me. And... Let's see if I can get a decent... Oh, lost traction. Mid-drive. And here's a speed section. Rest in peace, top speed. Part of the brakes. Ah, I don't have the acceleration. Let's see if I can mid drive it here again. I hit that. It helped us a little bit. boost Let's see who gets it final corner Let's see who got it who got it definitely have the top speed though wow there we go got it this time he's right there though hellfire's gone didn't realize that many top speed sections, but. Oh, he's got me acceleration here. Oh, I don't know. I do have a top speed advantage, though, it seems. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So we do through here. We'll flat out through there. He's still there. Wow. Go, Coquette, go! I got him. We got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. GG's. Light one in the Hellfire, followed by me in the Blackfin, and then Francis in the Blade. Blade's a beast. Look at that lap time difference. That Hellfire is a monster in the top speed. I mean, I didn't realize this track has so many top speed sections. You should get a GT500 Code Red. Those are like $200,000. I'm good. Never they asking for an, an at that point I'd buy a Lambo. <laughs> not no not no Mustang. I don't care what kind of Mustang it is. This track was so fun. Yeah, it's a good track. It's a really good track. The Hellfire, considering our, our band Carlos, the Hellfire is a really good pick. That and the um the Gauntlet Classic Custom would have been a good pick too. Need that garage store video, I have an idea. An idea how to organize my garages. Yeah, that's the most difficult part. Is the Xeno worth buying? 
Depends where you're gonna use it for, but if it's for performance, no. So it's, obviously, styling is all personal preference. Yeah, it's really expensive, too. Worst looking Benny's car? The faction dog? <laughs> That's kind of an intentional though, isn't it? Alright, um let's see, I guess we'll do sedans on this one. But we don't have banned sedans, I don't think. So I mean So you're brave. I'm gonna pick the Impaler just because, but obviously I, I know I know I'm gonna lose, but I'm still gonna pick it. Um, all right, we got two. We got we got two spots open. I'm just waiting for this guy to join, and then we'll start it. Imagine what the 5 MRP is going to be like on 6. Oof, that's going to be insane. But they're probably not going to release the PC ver version for a long time. So, going to have to gonna have to wait. Mr. Watch and you, welcome back. <laughs> Appreciate that. Got virus. Join. Oh, well, now we're full again. Kind of weird that we got two impalers in the same DLC. <laughs> yeah. Joining, joining, joining. Where are you joining from? You're sitting at a McDonald's to your PS5? Come on. Ritz, where are you joining from, bro? Did you join from the from, did you join from the main menu? Jesus. Are you still is it are you still trying to join? Oh there we go. My god, it took a while. Time for them to give us a new bison and saddler. Yes. Then this man has the idea. Well, we kinda already have the, the regular car car 4x4 so I don't think we need but that would be cool they give us some um, it'd probably be a car car though but I'm, I'm definitely on board for an updated bison based on the TRX with HSW too can you imagine give it like Hennessy Mammoth 1000 style bumpers and stuff like that Full players L Rockstar. <laughs> Bison Hellfire, I guess. Bison random two or three letters like Rockstar always does. STX, SS, SZ, ABCD, XYZ. What are your what are some of your favorite car movies? My favorite car movie of all time is probably Ford vs. Ferrari. That that was just very well made. Um, yeah, I kind of want to say that one. The Gumball Rally is a very good movie for its time, for those of you who haven't seen it. I think I think the full movie is on YouTube, actually, for free. Ugly game on blow up Rockstar servers. <laughs> oh my god. 
launching tomorrow. <laughs> it's not... <laughs> launching session. It doesn't say when, so it could be any time, you know? Tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday. <laughs> oh, look! There we go. There we go. Alright. Impaler time. Everybody pick the impaler, please. <laughs> Let's see how many... Oh, we got one Shankwamela. Our first tryhard. What else we got? We got Shankwamela, Shankwamela. Some Shafter V12s. Well, let's see how this goes. Smokey and the Bandit's amazing, too. Fast and Furious? No. <laughs> The first one's still my favorite, though, out of all the Fast and Furious films. It's just, like, nostalgic, you know? Remember Craig Lieberman told me that when when he saw the, the, the first, like, premiere of it, where only... I forgot what they call it. Where only the actors and certain people were invited to see it. Like, like the first showing or whatever. He, 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 he said he saw it, and he's like, oh, man. This movie's gonna be a complete flop. <laughs> <laughs> Little did he know what that would turn into. My goodness. What is wrong? What Rockstar? Oh, there we go. Was a Sith guy? Hmm, interesting. Oh, Gone in 60 Seconds. Yeah, it's a really good movie, too. Here we go. Car handles pretty good actually. We we definitely we have the handling for sure, but not the straight line speed compared to that shafter. Even though we're decently keeping up, but ooh, okay, that jump didn't help. Wow, thing handles well. Just needs more speed. What's funny is that this thing would have had HSW, it would have dominated the class completely. Okay, wait, this, this, this section should be pretty good. Doesn't have the acceleration, though. Adds a handling. Take that almost flat out through there. Interesting. What car is in first? That car is gone. Oh yeah, Reinhardt or Shafter V12. Or Shinkwamela. What's in front of me? Oh, it's a Reinhardt. Ooh, okay, it's a decreasing radius turn. That tree made the friend of my car like that was weird. Uh, I want top five. I'm getting beat by all. I think I'm the only impaler up here. <laughs> only impaler up here. And they always come back with the speed. Re. <laughs> Get back here! How, how dare you disrespect the old Impala? Come on, come back. <laughs> it's just an old car, man. It's just an old car. It's just an old car. Come on, come on, come on. This thing's like, I'm at max speed for like half the race. <laughs> That's how low the top speed is. <laughs> Come 
I can take this corner faster. He took that flat out too, wow. Never mind. There's that speed difference. Get that post. Or boost, or boost. Let's turn again. Remember this one. Got that tree again. No, I was right there. <laughs> Come on, man. I was so close. I thought I had him, but his acceleration just said, screw you, bro. I'm out of here. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Hey, you know what? I still got the top five. Oh, Alan. Alan was behind me and the Impaler as well. Representing. D. Francis as well. What are our lap times compared to... So Francis did a 158, you did a 2 and I did a 157, and then we had 157 and a V12, 156, wow, that shaft 155, and then the other shaft are edible to 155, yeah, this is way off, I mean, I, I, I pushed the hell out of this car on the last lap, I don't think it gets better than that. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't think this this car. It just literally what I said in my my customization review video. It just needs more straight line speed. The handling is there, just needs a little more straight line speed. Basically, <laughs> a little more speed, and it would definitely have it. How long you think your first live stream will be? What? Oh, first GTA 6 live stream will be. Um, that's, that's, pff, I have no idea. I still don't know what I'm even gonna, it's just gonna be so overwhelming. It's very overwhelming. That's gonna be. All right, here we go. Long haul as usual. It's already restricted to sedans. Um, wait, this is the transform version. What? What? Oops. 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 Well, <laughs> that's an oopsie daisy on my part. That's the wrong race. Uh, this is the transform variant. I was supposed to have the R variant, which is the themed one. Oopsie. All right. Well, we'll back out of here. And then <laughs> I'm going to start up a crew session. That's my bad. That's my bad. Sorry. Put the raw, put the transform version of long haul. You know, Tal Talladega Nights. Yep. L star. Well, this this time it's it's <laughs> it, the the L is on my part. My mistake. Um, all right. I think almost everybody's in the set. I think, yeah, it merges us in here. Or no? Oh, no, because we backed out. Okay, I'm going to start a crew session. Uh, close crew. Close crew. All right, I'm in the session. You guys can just go ahead and join the same way you would a car meet. running the session how did you make that money lots and lots of coyotes bogdan's bogdan the bogdan method that definitely doesn't involve accidentally lagging out of the finale <laughs> ceo of bra office 100 percent lockstar <laughs> lockstar <laughs>
heard bring in the Mac the Street Racing and Fast Eleven. I heard about that, yeah. We will see. It's probably gonna be like two scenes. I mean, Fast X had um the tenth one had uh, a few racing scenes in it, so. Gonna make CEO a brought to. Oh my god. 17 already. Turn right to go left. Indeed. I love how a red car emoji and a lightning bolt. It's just an, like immediate reference to Lightning McQueen. That's amazing. Yeah, 22. Not 21. 23, 24. Oh, it's better than 24. 25. Alright, we'll go ahead and start it up. And start it up. The right race this time. Recently played. Huh. That's where I got messed up. Because we did a transform one recently. That's. Whoops. That's where that came from. My mistake. <laughs> My mistake. Alright. Uh, yeah, I want to host. There we go. It's correct this time. <laughs> and all from last job and current session. So. Oh, boy. Well, that's quick. Whoa. Well, that's going to that's gonna be cool. And crew members, too. Why not? It's a party. Two spots left, right? It's full long haul, maybe. One spot. Oh, light got it. Let's go. Full 30 player long haul. Full 30 player long haul. Let's go. Oh, Light's getting close to level 1,000. Look at that. Light TH-1000 is getting close to level 1,000. Perfect. That's going to be amazing when he's at 1,000. You should just stay at that level. It matched perfectly. All right. You can see locked to the Impaler. See ya, Neko. Uh, eating, alright. I, I like that. I see the taxi impaler back there. That thing looks hilarious. I love that. Look at the taxi. That's amazing. I love that. Here we go. No contact for the first checkpoint. We got two cabs. Three. Like three cabs. Here we go. This thing handles well, so it shouldn't be too bad of a long haul. The only time you'll see this many impalas. Oh my god. I love the taxi build. That looks hilarious. With the hard stand livery. Huh. It works. From far away, it looks, like, it looks like a taxi from far away. That's awesome. Taxi build and our horsepower. <laughs> it's a thousand, actually. Look at Penguin's build. That is the most early 2000s thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> That uh, looks pretty cool, actually, though. Curb boost. Curb boost. Ah! Rosa, you haven't driven this car that much. You're, you're gonna learn to appreciate it in this race because it, the handling, you, you don't expect it to be as good as it is. It, it handles well. Handles almost like a two-door. 
if that makes sense. It, it just it handles well. Upstream. Wow, well, that's well, that's upstream. We got a pretty good speed out of that. Greetings, virtual vehicle enthusiast. <laughs> that should be my real my real channel name. <laughs> virtual vehicle enthusiast. <laughs> Saved it. Look at that. This flat out there too. Slipstream, yep. In an alternate universe, virtual vehicle enthusiast of EVE. <laughs> <laughs> Virtual vehicle, that's funny. The trap put Impala SS. Sorry, Oxymi! That's my bad. I'll wait for you. I, I was, that was my, I, 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 my bad. My bad. Alright, we're good. Ah! Sorry! I think you're good. Yeah, you're good. Six plays. Look at this. Full speed. Wow. That has really good response to the steering. <clears throat> Break a little bit here and that that is impressive. For all the info, no problem. <laughs> Gonna sleep, see you by the next car meet. See ya. Oh my god. All the, all the cars references. Top five is always the goal. Word. <laughs> Bruh. People ramp so much. Eh, it's long haul things. What's up? What's up? What's up, you? Don't let people catch up. Oh, they are catching up. Decently. You, you have a massive pack back there. That's like, what? Maybe like... 12th? No, like 15th or so? You guys still stream each other, you can catch up very easily. We're all driving the same car. Oh my. What was that? That car like flew, but it the way it flew like horizontally, that was so weird. <laughs> I believe I could fly for real. We got taxi again. Feb in the ta I hope that I hope that one wins honestly. I hope I hope you win Feb. T taxi needs to win. <laughs> Is your meter running? It's gonna be a very expensive trip. <laughs> oh, we max out the speedometer, it looks like. Yep, max out the speed. Jesus. Flipstream go burr. Oh no. Oh no. 
Oh, okay, we're good. We're fine. We're fine. We're fi ah! Well, that's good. That's, we're good. Crazy taxi for real. Escape a timeout. Oh my god. Oh my god, what did I do? I'm gonna respawn. Oh, it spawned me over here. That's nice. Now I'm in that pack I was talking about earlier. <laughs> now we gotta play catch up. Play catch up. Legendary. Ooh. Oh. I have no, no idea. Apparently Nightbot tied you off for some reason. It's, it's fixed now. He almost pulled Doc Hudson. Hmm, <laughs> hmm. Teeth. We're still trying to catch up. How, how far is your client, Feb? You can drive it for a while. <laughs> okay, I thought, I mean, I guess the, the handling, I got a little uh, overzealous there with the handling. <laughs> One winner, 42 losers. I eat losers for breakfast. <laughs> Play lightning, you ready? Yeah, lightning ready. Da -na 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 -na. Da -na -na. Childhood memories. In Leonita. Le Leonita. Florida. Ah, Rockstar. I wonder when the next GTA 6 trailer is probably going to come out. Like, probably what? Like, uh. Who knows? I hope it's a gameplay trailer. They're probably not going to do a gameplay trailer until, like, we're really, really, really close. Well, like another crazy cinematic trailer. Gonna be a little more like look into um, Jason and Lucia's story. He betrayed me. That that video game theory made was really well made. No, GTA Six. I don't care for a new Impala, I should have exhaust. Yeah, I don't know why they, they didn't do a dual exit exhaust for the back. I don't, I don't, that's like a complete missed opportunity. I don't know why they didn't do that. And, and then they just needed to make, like, dual exit exhaust, um, a little bit quicker in a straight line, and that's pretty much it. That's all I had to do. The car would have been perfect. At least to me. Three piston cups. He did what in this cup? <laughs> Awesome to see you work on your zero one. The black lugs are appreciated, man. We got some more stuff coming. Not the craziest mods in the world, but I figured I'd film most of the stuff I'm doing to it. Do you say it needs a top five spot? I'm trying. I'm gonna take the loop. Let's take the loop. I just, I, 
What was that? <laughs> what was that? That was so bad. That's the worst loop in the history of loops. I was <laughs> Upstream. There we go. That's what I needed. We're zooming now. Flip again, for real. Wow, this thing's a little beast. Way to handle. Such a good car. Just needed more speed. The stream was brought to you by Rusty's. <laughs> Caught up, we caught up. The ninth. Who's in front? Penguin. Alex Eda messed up. Oh, it was like a little bit of a wreck it seems. I caught up very quickly. Bruh. We do the loop easily. Oh my god, I'm gonna get. Oh my. Oh, oh god. Oh god. That's not gonna. Okay. Find some out. Risky maneuvers. We're back at the front. Let's go. Man, if this was the last lap, I would have had a fighting chance up here. <laughs> Man, I probably would have won, bro. Look at that. Nobody behind me. There's nobody behind me. Bruh, I would have won. This is the last lap in my head. <laughs> in my mind. <laughs> I'm going to pretend it's the last lap. <laughs> that sucks, bro. I would have won. Man. Yay, I won, race is over. <laughs> ah! Now watch, then the next one I'm gonna be like in 15th place. What, one more lap? This is a worldwide race, yep. <laughs> it's long haul for a reason, it goes around the entire map, and we do two laps of it, it's, tra it's a tradition. And we always do it in, the, in these streams at the end. After 14 minutes of suffering, we made it to a second lap. <laughs> oh, man. Would be a lot quicker if this car had a higher top speed. Just saying. HSW would have been like... You know, they put HSW on the most random cars. And I feel like this one needed it the most. Honestly. Considering how greedy Rockstar is, they could have easily... I'm surprised they didn't make this a top-tier performing sedan on purpose. Like, a sedan's class. They would have... Maybe they forgot. That, that's something Rockstar would do, you know? M make you spend a bunch of money to have the top-tier performing, you know, vehicle in a specific class. There's not a single HSW sedan currently, so... This would have been the opportunity right here. Be one of the best sedans in GTA 6. <laughs> yeah, whatever you want, just add dot 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 and GTA 6 to it. Next update, maybe. This car is so dirty. It looks like it's brown now. This car was black in the beginning of the race. It's brown. Really brown. Bruh.
I've been, I have been mudding apparently. <laughs> Took this thing mud bogging apparently. <laughs> that looks like an ugly car. <laughs> Bruh. Last Evo. Yep. You got that weight reduction mod for your rear glass. You just brake check me, you mother trucker. <laughs> Jesus. I just need a pit stop for real. I did respawn at one point. Right after the the Sandy Shore spot. Virtual road range. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what about the next incoming week's update? What do you think about it? It's just the it, it it's I don't understand why Rockstar is hyping it up. It's just a, a basically a heist with Vincent with two cars. That's it. And Rockstar's considering it like a whole separate update. I don't get it. The Avenger missions worth doing? No. That's the one from the uh, Mercenaries update. They're garbage. They, they they like trash payouts for your time. Don't even bother. Don't even buy the operations. What's it called? The the terminal you need that upgrade for the missions? Yeah, don't don't even bother buying it. It's not worth it. The missions themselves are kind of fun, but the the payout is trash. Like why waste your time doing that to be paid garbage money? Do we have Subarus in this game? Yeah, I mean the the Sultans have some Subaru in them, even though it's a mix with a Lexus. But uh, you know, we have the the classic. You know, you know it's got a little bit of Evo in there too. <laughs> I guess the Sultan RS Classic is probably like the most um, I guess Subaru esque vehicle. We also kind of have the uh, what's the name of that one car? The um. The one that's exclusive to next gen, what's it called? Uh, the two door. Oh, I forgot the name of it. The one that has HSW. Which one? Oh, the S95, yeah. Yeah, you got that one in there. Yeah. The FRS slash BRZ thing. Why are you gonna do a Range Rover car meet? <laughs> Range Rover car meet? Depreciation broken down car meet? <laughs> uh, that's a good theme, depreciation meet. It's like all like heavily depreciated cars. <laughs> and like, you know, real. Maserati, Bentley, Rolls Royce, luxury cars. Say, oh my god, that'd be fuck out, that'd be hilarious. Depreciation car me. My man went around the sides. We need a rice car me again. We do that once a year, April Fools. Ford versus Chevy car mate. We've done that before. We did. Have we done that before? I don't think we've done Ford versus Chevy actually. Yeah, we did the big three muscle. I think we did Vapid versus Revlada once. Can't remember. Ford versus Chevy's a good one. Chabarek only meat, cardboard meat. The, 
the one we have yet to do, which will be kind of fun, is like a wrong class carving. Even though some of them are going to be up for debate, you know, but... This could technically still be in sedans, even though it should have been a muscle, but... We got a lot more cars up here now. It always happens towards the end, everybody starts playing it a bit more safe <laughs> to try to stay more consistent up front. <laughs> Ten up here, man, that's really impressive. Cheap car worth buying? Oh, IRL. O honestly, like, any like used Lexus, like older Lexus, it just because they're reliable and they're nice, they're pretty nice, you know? So, yeah. And you're not, and you're not, you know, you're not driving the typical, you know, when, when you think of, like, good car that's you know, reliable money-wise, you think Toyota. But, you know, you still go a step up above with a Lexus. So you have, you know, more of a luxurious car and similar pricing to the, a comparable Toyota of that same year. G35, 350Z, yep. Citroen only? Oh my god. PSN. I should make that a command. I think I, I think I put... I have YouTube as a command. I think I have Instagram as a command. And Discord as a command. I didn't, I didn't do PSN. That's a good one. I do PSN and Gamertag, I guess. Oh, sorry. But PSN is Mr. Car Addict, but you need to be in the crew to join. Well, we're getting somewhat close to the end here. Final stretch back the other way for the most part. We got this one, then we get off the highway up ahead. Uh, yep. Yeah close. Only about a little less than four minutes left of this race. Karen is pronounced Corinne. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. Corinne. <laughs> we need a Nightbot car meme. Oh my god. We should just have ChatGPT put together a car meet theme for us randomly. <laughs> Join together here. Oh my god, look how many cars are up here. Wow, I am impressed. Very impressed. Clutch mode activated. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna get like tenth place. <laughs> Look at how many cars are up here. You know what would be hilarious? Imagine if all of them were like yellow taxi builds. That'd be <laughs> like Febs. That'd be hilarious. Oh, somebody blew up. Oh, Alan died. Rip Alan. How'd you die out? Ah, oh, bro, you don't you don't pass like that, man. You don't. And sometimes it's not worth the risky pass. Sometimes it's not worth it. I honestly hope Feb wins. I, I love that taxi build. <laughs> honestly, Feb, if you would have brought that to the meet, I probably would have picked that as one of my top favorites. <laughs> Am I going up front? Bad idea. Bad idea. Oh god. See if they break. Are they gonna break? Yeah. 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 Pretty good. Oh, wreck back there. Intense now. Final few corners. Oh. 
comes down to this. scared of what's gonna happen here my car is so ugly right now it looks like someone just threw turds all over it <laughs> taxi go taxi go taxi taxi oh boy Jesus Oh my god, what is this, man? What is this? It's not like the last the last lap. It's a complete opposite. Oh my god. Ah. Ooh! Ooh! Somebody wrecked. Oh, oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Oh, 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 he's gonna pass. He's gonna zoom by me. Can I get a slipstream back? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Come on, do it, come on. Let's go, let's go. I have to thank Rockstar for that last live stream because sometimes it doesn't work, sometimes it does. We, we got really lucky there. Really lucky there. GG's. I love... We got another attack. This one's just yellow. It's a stock one. Stock rigged. <laughs> yes, totally rigged. Uh, pure luck. It's pure luck. These long hauls, it's always pure luck in the end because it, 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 if there's a wreck, if this, if this, you never know what's going to happen. You never know what's going to happen. Charger GT or Chrysler S? Oh, the, yeah, the, the Charger GT is the V6 that has all of, like, the scat pack looking mods on it. The hood and the rear bumper and all the and all that, and the front bumper. I mean, that's a cool car. I think they're just overpriced for what they are. Like, a Charger GT is literally, like, old scat pack pricing. It makes no sense. You might as well buy a used scat pack, personally. They ever done an F1 long haul? Nope. After 28 minutes of suffering, <laughs> yeah, that was that was quite intense. That was quite intense. I s somehow, s somehow got lucky there at the end. I thought for sure Oxivi had it. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the 90s and early 2000s car meet, and of course the little bit of driving we did to various gas stations. That was kind of cool, um, and of course the racing playlist afterwards. If you want to join the next one, all the info is down below. As always, I alternate between PS5 and Xbox Series X slash S every other week. Thanks again for watching, guys. Have a great night, and I'll see you in the next one.